apple. Um. Well, we made it to the airport. We even have a few minutes in the lounge and all went really smoothly with this little guy. Woohoo! Do you want some more apple? Yes. <laughs> it was an early morning, wasn't it? Yeah. Mama woke you up at 6.30? Yeah? <laughs> because we're going to Hawaii today? Are you excited? Where did the airplane go? We gotta board the airplane in just a few minutes. Yeah. Let's eat our apple first. And go to the potty. <laughs> we got in our seat and we're excited, right? Flight number 38. This time he walked all the way down the aisle. Pulling his little airplane suitcase. It was really cute. got our luggage, we met up with Oppo, and Jack was just such a rock star on the flight. Now we are waiting for Aerie to come by with the car. Hey mister, are you in Hawaii? Yeah. Where are you? Yeah. Is that the coolest car seat in the world? Yeah it is. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for coming to pick us up. Since he's fallen asleep in the car, we decided to take a little detour to the beach. Dinner. Dinner. You excited? Bedtime for this guy, but dinner for us. And look at this view. Holy moly. Wow. I showed that. Okay, see so that it's a I mean, it's kind of pretty here. I don't know. You don't want to eat outside? Look at his Mickey underwear. Look at those underpants. How cute are those? Hooray! Are you happy and you know that we visit it? Are you happy and you know the lovely? Hooray! <laughs> Are these they showed up earlier 
Good morning, it's Saturday and we are in the car on our way to the workshop. Ready Jack? Exciting, right? I've got my coffee and I've already spilled on myself. Not good. Traffic, lots of traffic. We're here. What you doing? Are you ready? <gasps> Guess what Kim made you? Look, Auntie Kim made you this. <laughs> so good, right? That says Jack on it. Isn't that cute? <laughs> yes. That's yours. You got it! Just scenic drive down to Kailua Beach. Had to make a healthy stop. You're big? No, big. And you're eating Doritos? <laughs> We've been eating terribly. I mean, terribly well, but this is why I need this green smoothie. <laughs> Each visit was short and sweet, and now we're headed to get garlic shrimp, yay! Okay, we made it! I'm excited to try Romy's! The shrimp was great, but they didn't have the one that we usually get, which is like the garlic shrimp, the number one. So we had to do the peel and then dip in the garlic butter, but it was really good. Um, and there are snails down here, and I showed Jack, and he was like, wow. So I thought I'd show you guys too. Can you see them? There's one up there, and there's two down here. There's one there and one there. Yeah. No. Puppy! Hi, puppy! 
Obama was here. That looks so good. Thank you. I know. We got it. Yay! <laughs> Hey buddy, we're about to leave for the airport. Are you so happy or sad? Both? Yeah, look at this car. And I've got my bag and my flip flops on. So right before we left the house, I was getting ready to put Jack's shorts on and I crouched down and I busted my jeans, like <laughs> right in the butt. And I just decided to go with it. And yeah, I've definitely gained at least five pounds on this trip, but that's okay. <laughs> we got all checked in. Jack's got our tickets, right? And then we're under this gigantic ceiling fan. Show off the Show off with the ceiling fan? Jackson popcorn. <laughs> I got you a plate of grapes too. Good? <laughs> Just drop him in the carrier and then we're gonna head to the gate. Are you excited? I like to give him a surprise when we get on the plane, right? This time it's Smarties! <laughs> Candies, that's right. tote bag, his little suitcase, and two checked suitcases, and we're out at the curb waiting for Ayi. We did it, bud. You do want milk now? Okay. Cindy picked us up from the airport. We got Chick-fil-A on the way home and ate no, it for that dinner. Is yeah, I'm using it as a <laughs> oh God, I'm using it as a tripod. No, no. Okay, I'll take it off. I'll take it off. Heesh. All right, so Jack is very happy to be home. He's playing with all of his toys. You can take your girl top now. I'm gonna use it again. Mama says, I mean, do you do that? Hey, you know what? I'll do it from here. Yeah. Jackson is very happy to be home because he's got all his toys spread out. All the ones that he missed so much, like his grill and his fire truck and his bus. It is 10.20 and we need to go to bed soon. All right, thanks for coming along. Hope you had a really fun time. Aloha. Back in the studio and I thought it'd be fun to show you the bag that I brought back with all the crafty stuff, my printer, some pieces that I gathered while I was there, as well as some additional supplies that I took with me. So I've got the actual a washi tape holder from Sakura Lala and it's so awesome. She gave it to me and I put a bunch of washi tapes in it and I think it's great for travel. I love this one in particular. It's made of really smooth 
paper that won't affect the washi tape at all. And when you peel it off, it's like new. So it's a great thing to travel with. This is my exclusive stamp set with Sakura Lala, and I'll show you a flip through of the Traveler's Notebook that I made. I actually made this cover the last time I was in Hawaii, as well as this left side page. That's with the first set that I did with Ari at Sakura Lala, and I just glued that page to the cover, and then I decorated some of this on the plane, very little of it on the plane, and most of it was actually at um, the house when I was just having some downtime, I wanted to put it together and I got most of this done on that Sunday where I didn't film any video really. So I was busy working on this book and I just put Jack's artwork in from the plane. I also did some stamping and wrote on a little journaling card and also just put random little bits from our trip. I love including stuff like that state of Hawaii paperwork, as well as printing out my photos right when I'm on the trip. And everything is actually more fresh in your memory. And so this page doesn't have any photos, but it has journaling and stamping and some watercolor action. I've enclosed a postcard and a business card from the store, as well as a business card from the restaurant that we ate. And the burger was amazing. So if you guys go there, I highly recommend it. It's one of the best burgers I've ever had in my life. I included the happy anniversary card from the flowers that JC sent. He was actually in New York at the time of this trip and uh, the workshops at the event place were amazing. We had some awesome women in the class and it was just so much fun. It's always fun getting together with like-minded creatives in person and it worked out so well. So there were two workshops total. I left that page kind of blank and I might fill in stuff on the left here, but I might not. I might just leave it like this. But he literally woke up on the floor <laughs> and we had a beautiful Sunday where we just really rested. I made a little mistake there, so I just said, oops, did some stamping. I plan on adding some embellishments to this page, uh, went to the Dole Pineapple Place, as well as, oh, that actually was from a pineapple. And then this is the pineapple whip from the place. So I just enclosed a bunch of stuff and I'm going to try to finish this up a little bit. I wanted to show you how I did the writing in here though, because I did get new pens and markers that are amazing. So let me get to that. These are Copic multi-liner pens and they're linked below. The one I use throughout much of the book is the point one, so it's a very fine point. They feel so great and smooth when I'm writing with them and apparently they're also refillable, both the ink and the tip, which is very cool. I fell in love with this brush one and it's funny because it says BS on it. Well, maybe that's only funny to me and fifth graders, but anyway, I haven't had success with other brush pens, but for some reason, this one worked really well right from the get-go. It's not as long or soft as the Tombow's or Tim Holtz markers I've attempted this with, and I found everything to flow really, really naturally with this one. Thank you so much for coming along for our Hawaii trip. Would love if you gave this video a thumbs up and feel free to leave any questions or comments below. Hope you're inspired to go on adventures and keep those creative juices flowing.